Welcome everyone. Today we are doing a five minute reformer mobility break. So this is the perfect quick session for you. If you've been sitting for a while and you just need a little boost, a little burst of energy, we're going to be moving the whole body. I'm going to start with one red or one heavy spring on and turn back toward the back of the reformer. And I like my legs on the outsides of the shoulder rest for a roll down for back rowing, but you can put your legs on the inside as well. This just feels better on my hips. And I'm gonna start nice and tall, holding the straps in my hands. And then I'm gonna make sure I have room behind me and I'm gonna roll down, exhale, and just flex the spine. And then I'm gonna come forward over my legs, a little stretch here on the hamstrings, and then stack the spine back up. Again, exhale roll back, then roll forward over the legs, and then stack the spine up. Let's do it again just like that. So you're going to roll back, sinking down, and feel that roundness of the spine. Then come forward and stack everything up. Now what I want you to do is start the same way. So roll down, exhale, and then reach the arms out, and you're going to push them back and fold forward, reaching, reaching, reaching those arms. And then just stack the spine up as you bring the arms back to the start. Doesn't that feel great? Let's start again. Exhale back. Inhale, open the arms. Now exhale, push the hands back as you fold forward. And then just lower the arms, bring them back to the start position as you stack the spine up. Roll back and open. Press and fold over. And come all the way up. One more time. Roll back. Press open, push back as you fold your body back over your legs, and then just stack the spine and come all the way back up. Let's spin this around, same springs, and I'm gonna do the same thing with my legs. I'm gonna keep them almost as if there were shoulder rests here and I'm on the outsides of the shoulder rest. I'm gonna grab the straps in my hands, sit tall, and let's press forward. From here, just fold, like a spine stretch forward. You can even flex your feet and reach. Then I want you to sit up. Feel the stretch, the straps pulling you back, and let them extend. And then open the arms out, bring your spine back to a long line, and bend your elbows. Again, push the arms forward, flex your feet, and just stretch over them. Now gradually stack the spine back up, reaching the arms up, but keep going. Don't stop at a straight spine. Extend it, let those arms get pulled back and then just relax them down and come back to your start. Exhale forward. Inhale, lift up, get that stretch and circle around. Exhale, flex forward. Last time, lift up, reach, 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 reach. Keep reaching, now start reaching back. You can even look up here and then come all the way around. Now let's put those straps back out of the way. And I'm gonna go now with one heavy and one light. So a red and a blue. Then I'm gonna uh, put my hands on the wood frame here and I'm just gonna cap. So just round back and then I'm gonna shift the weight back toward my heels. From here, I'm gonna start to lengthen my spine tail to head, and start moving the carriage out. I'm gonna let the hips sink, and I'm gonna come all the way down into this st nice stretch position with the hips sinking into the well. And then I'm gonna allow the carriage to come forward, lifting the chest. And from there, I'm just gonna sit back to the start. Now, if that's too much resistance, you can let go of that blue spring and just use the heavy. Lengthen. Control it because it moves a lot easier now. Sink and up and just sit back. I like the heavy spring better than the heavy and the light because I'm looking for mobility here. I'm not looking to increase strength necessarily today. And then sit back. Again, lengthen the spine. Push the carriage out. Let the hips sink. Lift the chest. And sit back. Now from here, just have a seat and we're just going to take your arms out to the side and just give me a rotation in one direction 
and in the other one more time, turn and turn and just a side bend just to get the spine moving in all those different directions and come back to the top. Guys, that does it for our mobility break. I hope that you feel refreshed and ready to get on with your day. Thanks for joining me. I look forward to seeing you again next time.